Hi, I'm Holly Draper, and I'm the CEO and managing partner here at the Draper Law Firm. I'm coming to you today to tell you a few tips for things that you can do to prepare if you are considering filing for a divorce or you think a divorce may be coming from the other side. First, if you're not in the know on the finances, do whatever you can to get in the know. Write things down, take screenshots of things, get copies of statements, do whatever you can so you'll know what was there at that time. That can help us if we need to look for other bank accounts or if the other side doesn't produce something, the more information you can get, the better. Number two, this is especially true, again, if you have not been involved in the finances, is to meet with a financial advisor who works with people going through divorce. If you need a recommendation, ask us, we're happy to refer you. Um, but find out what it's going to take for you to be able to live on your own, what's realistic, what's not. Number three, if you have been a stay-at-home parent, make finding full-time work a high priority. The reality is that most people do not have a large enough estate to sustain them after a divorce if they are not working. And even in the best of circumstances, child support is not usually enough. Number four, write things down. If something noteworthy happens, write it down at or near the time of the event so that you have a good record. Something may not seem super significant at the time, but when you put them all together, it can really add up down the road. And it's much easier if you keep records along the way. And number five, similarly, keep a calendar. You know, if you have already separated, are you spending more time with the kids or is the other side? Um, if noteworthy, noteworthy things are happening, write it down on the calendar at or near the time of the event. And it is really going to be helpful in your case down the road. I hope these tips have helped and we wish you all the best. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out.